The dawn and inception of Amapiano is the best thing to ever grace the southern hemisphere of which the same can be said with the origins and the spread of SA Hip Hop dating from 2014 until now. With the best verses of the year emerging from Ama Piano artists, we see the likes of Young Stana rapping on piano beats but being greatly accepted as hip hop artists. And the SA Hip Hop OGs Vele, they've been fusing hip hop production with piano elements. Could this be that Ama Piano is a new SA Hip Hop? Well, stay tuned to find out. Well, FYI, SA Hip Hop is very much alive, but gear, you blended not sing it if you're saying it is dead, because it has evolved. I am saying this because who can ever deny the potential verse of the year that came from the Mapiano artist and came with some crazy flows and the best raps. And I'm talking about Madumane with his verse from Izolo with the song he did with Dali Wonga. Sheesh. And not forgetting the newest kid on the block, Young Stunner, who just dropped his album called Not Too Much Beautiful Beginnings. And of course, when he was joining the whole day yesterday with people accepting him warmly. And of course, even the SA Hip Hop community saying, no, 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 no. Welcome home. Because FYI, the guy was a hip hop artist, but now he's rapping on a piano. Even Nota himself came out and said that, mm, 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 mm. that the hip hop future is in safe hands with this man. Safe Hands. Even Sleek on Live came out yesterday and said, "No, no, 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 no." Post this guy. This is a win for SA Hip Hop and I'm a piano. So do you see where I'm going with this? The infusion, it's working. Hmm. Huh? Wait for it. Here it comes. Almost there. Don't you see it already? Come on. Oh my God! Wow! Well, if you haven't been following thus far, this is what I'm saying. Look here. Vocalistic, when he was introduced into the scene, he was a hip-hop artist but soon jumped on my piano afterwards and look what happened to him. He started blowing up to the rest of the world. Hmm? Currently, Vocalistic is nominated for an MTV EMA award. Tell me that is not something huge and big of course. Look at how the world has accepted my piano. Hmm? Even Young Stana was a hip hop artist and dropped his album right now, currently, of which is infused with Ama Piano and is rapping on it. And it also featured the likes of Big Zulu on this project. Tell me you're missing something right now. And of course, Maduman has been rapping and rapping after song, after song, after song, after song, after song. Hot, that is. And those are raps, good raps. You're telling me. There's no infusion there? Nice. Well, even Casper Yavez saw the win and decided not to hold back and jump on Ama Piano. KO on this song, K Hover, that is Ama Piano infused hip hop song, and uh, AKN and Costa Teach on their recent album, which is titled You Are Welcome, is also infused with hip hop and Ama Piano. A lot of artists have done that, including Blackie himself. So tell me, I'm a piano is not a new age of SA hip hop. Hmm? You can do it! Well, I must make it clear that uh, finding a sound or just having a sound is an evolving thing. It's not a stagnant thing. Because looking back at the origins of SA hip hop, but back when MT was still as big as how my piano is right now, he was doing his thing with ATM. And then soon, that sound evolved over and over and now we are on Ama Piano. It is the next new sound that is currently and that is warmly accepted by the world. Well, even the likes of Major League DJs have taken the hashtag Ama Piano to the world hashtag literally now as they've taken Ama Piano to the actual world. 
They were also seen in Amsterdam. No, 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 no. English now. <coughs> they were also seen in Amsterdam. Yes, that's it, right? Yes. They were also seen in Amsterdam rocking a crowd heavily. The crowd growing wild, wild, wild west. No, no, no. Wild, wild, wild south. Yeah. Well, personally, I think the fight between SA Hip Hop and Amabiano should just end right now. SA Hip Hop is not dead, it just evolved. It is now within Amabiano, and it's one thing, same thing, funny things. SA Hip Hop has evolved to Amabiano. Cause, man, those Amabiano artists are rapping hard on those beats. So instead of fighting, SA Hip Hop artists should just take Amabiano beats and rap on them. That is one sound, that is our sound that we are taking to the world and the world is warmly accepting us for that. Well, let's have a conversation. Do you think that Te Amabiano is a new SA Hip Hop or do you think that these two genres should be just left to be separate as they were just like that? Hmm? Well, comment in the comment section below and uh, tell me what you're thinking him and if you haven't subscribed, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, you see it? Hmm? Yeah. Ah, that one. And hey, if you really enjoyed this video, please hit that like button with a thumbs up and please share, 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 share this video as this will help us grow the channel and for us to continue to give you new discoveries like this one back and back and back again. Become officially part of the gang, 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 notification gang that is by turning on your notification bell so you can become notified whenever you are dropping in guild leaks, of course. And hey, man. Hey man, hey man, this is Zeta Thank you for watching.